To calculate the molar mass for CuSO4 5H2O, that's copper 2 sulfate pentahydrate, let's first figure out the molar mass for the CuSO4. When we do that, we find the molar mass for the CuSO4 to be 159.62. So next, we'll calculate the molar mass of the H2O. When we add up those two hydrogens and that one oxygen from the periodic table, we end up with 18.02 is the molar mass. And we're going to put parentheses around that and multiply that by 5 and then add it to the molar mass of CuSO4. When we do that, we're going to end up with the molar mass for the compound, the CuSO4 5H2O, and that is 249.72, and our units are grams per mole. So the key here is to realize that this 5 applies to the whole water molecule, and that this dot here, it doesn't mean multiply. The dot means we're just going to add the 5 H2Os to the molar mass of the copper sulfate. This is Dr. B with the molar mass for copper 2 sulfate pentahydrate. Thanks for watching.